everyone, we're the Reno Girls. I'm Monica. And I'm Dandela. And if this is your first time here, then welcome. We want you to like this video and subscribe for future videos. And share. Yes, definitely. And if you are past subscribers, right. welcome, welcome back. back. Welcome back. Um, so we're glad you're here. And today we first we want to before we get started, we want to talk about that we are in our new home studio setup. <laughs> so we've had some little minor glitches as yeah. we're trying to get used to the equipment, right? The shine is real. Yes. Yeah, so, I never wear makeup, but oh honey, gosh, I need some today. So forgive us, because it's like look at my forehead, it's so big. Okay. And look at my nose. <laughs> So okay, sorry, right. okay, we just have to get used to it, you know, right. the settings and whatnot. Um, but anyways, we're glad to bring you this information today. We are going to talk about what to buy with those starter business credit vendor accounts. Right, like your net 30s, like your yes. Granger, your Quill, your HD Supply, and um, we also do CEO creative is yes. um, one of our other vendor accounts that we utilize because we've gotten a lot of feedback from other entrepreneurs other um, small business owners those who are starting in the game those who are starting getting business credit saying um, you know what should they buy from it because one they don't really see a lot of things that maybe translate over to their business so you know how can we just like pinpoint some things like what do we buy so we're going to talk to you about what we buy for our short-term rental business Right. So mainly for us, um, what we purchase is, of course, tissue, um, paper towels, definitely cleaning supplies because we do have some in-house cleaners that we um, have on staff. Um, also, we purchase um, coffee, um, anything like that that can be used um, in the short-term rentals. We do that for um, our vendor accounts um, and we do also office supplies because we do you know having um, a small office so we do get office supplies paper um, etc that we also use um, to purchase on those accounts however we have found like Monica was saying that some people don't know what to buy but honestly just buy anything if you have a home office just buy whatever you're going to use for your house you know I mean, you need tissue at home, you need paper at home to print. Um, there's just a myriad of things that you can use. Coffee, I mean, anything that you can write off for your business, then that's what you need to be purchasing um, on those accounts. Even if you haven't really al already kind of like started your business or you don't really need those supplies, you really just want to purchase items that you're going to use so that you can get the credit um, yes. on your Dun & Bradstreet. Right. So like coffee, what has been your feedback like from the coffee purchase? You, we purchased that from Quill or um, which one? Sometimes I do Sam's, but when we do our quarterly Quill, I do purchase the Quill. But I just get what I get from Sam's, like the Folgers. Oh, okay. And it's yeah. just as good. Because yeah. I know some people kind of wonder that, like, I don't see these brands that I see, uh, you know, or that I use from other places. But they have big brands. Yeah, they do. Yeah. And it's just more expensive, but well, it's yeah. expensive for a reason because they know that people are wanting to use those accounts to get the credit. Yeah. You know, that's why everything is a lot more expensive because going to Quill, Granger, HG Supply, all of those, they are more expensive than going to Sam's or Walmart or somewhere like that. So, but the benefits outweigh the cost. So, yeah, that's the thing with that. For sure. So let's do a quick re recap. So starter vendors such as Quill, Granger, um, Uline even, yes. and um, HD Supply. CEO Creative. CEO Creative. So um, purchases can be made for them for your home office. Yes. Um, items like paper, uh, pens, office right. supplies. Yes. Um, for us, we use, like Dondella was saying, um, uh, quill for coffee or um, um some food items sometimes food items if we're gonna supply oh, that we used um, to do snacks yeah, like we i mean we do, do snacks. snacks but we used to do like snack snacks yeah <laughs> <laughs> 
like we like we 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 used to get some reviews that people said like oh my gosh you can like really eat off of yes what you what y'all provide right they have snacks yes <laughs> absolutely so um so those are just some items that you can purchase so we hope that kind of helps kind of you know when you so the next time that you're going on the website that maybe you're thinking like ah okay I can kind of see how I can parlay this um like Gondella was saying earlier I mean toilet tissue paper towels now we know that you need those items and you could find a a way to use those exactly you know so um just to kind of jog your memory or give you some tips on um you know how you could use it in your businesses going forward right because you're building your credit and it's a tax write-off yeah Exactly, at the end of the year. all those goodies. Yes. Yeah. So we hope we, that you found this helpful. Um, if there's any other questions that you may have, like starter vendor accounts or anything relating to Airbnb, or just managing your business, specifically business strategy, um, we're an authority in those areas. So you feel free to comment or send us a message um, or book a consult with us. All right. It's free. Yeah. You know, we all like free. We do too. Yes, free ninety nine. Mm-hmm. Yes. Um, again, um, like and share, and uh, reach out to us, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.